Hello, Taurus. That's my lady from my lady's way tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly weekend reading for the weekend of in the weekend of April 8th through the 11th, 2022. The cards I'm using today are tattoo ink no tattoo tarot ink intuitions by Diana McCullough. No, Diana Collins and Johnny McCulloch. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with the Taurus? Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right, so we got the King of Wands here. So I can see a few things here. Um, with this King of Wands reverse, I feel like somebody is holding back their emotions. Somebody's emotions are cut off, not there. Um, I feel like somebody could not care about your feelings, okay? Definitely heartless. I feel like somebody wants to be free, okay? Somebody wants their freedom, okay? So we got the moon card reversed here. So I do feel like this was a secret at some point, but now the secret is coming out. Okay, Seek, secret is out, jig is up, gig is up, whatever they say. I don't know. Y'all y'all gonna tell me anyway. Okay, so I'm gonna secret come out. Could be dealing with some Pisces energy as well, okay? Ooh, so we got the 10 of coins here. So I do feel like um somebody may be getting ready to get a large sum of money or somebody could be just happy okay but i do feel like money money yeah yeah money coming in all right let's keep going mm -hmm. all right so we got the eight of coins reversed here so i do feel like somebody may have some money coming in and they don't have to work hard for it okay so this makes me feel like somebody possibly getting ready to get a loan or get in a position where they don't have to work as much as they used to yeah all right but more money, less less um work. Okay. Well, that's good. Let's keep going. Somebody could be dealing with a Capricorn Taurus Virgo. So this could be your energy. You could just want more money and do less work. So somebody could be plotting and planning how to do this. Okay. All right. So we got the King of Cups here. So I do feel like somebody is coming in with some kind of given mentality. Oh goodness. All right. <sighs> So it looks like somebody's getting ready to have a relationship with somebody. Um, I think it's for money. It's for money. Like I'm dealing with you, but it's just for money. It could be a friendship. It could be a business friendship. Um, but I do feel like I'm only here for money. I feel like somebody else wants more. Okay. But I just want the money and less work. Okay. Like somebody could be making a relationship with the boss. So they don't have to do as much work as everybody else, okay? Mm-hmm. All right, so we got the death card reverse here. So I do feel like this is going to become a toxic situation, okay? Of course. Somebody getting into a situation. It could be Scorpio energy as well here. But somebody's getting into a relationship mainly to benefit, okay? So I'm not being your friend because I want to be your friend. I want to be your friend so that I don't have to do all this extra work or um, so you can give me money or, um, you know, just something like that, okay? And then you can only do that for so long because still, like, I feel like I shouldn't or, or can't say stuff to you because um, I know that it'll mess up our relationship, okay? So it's like a double-edged sword here. All right, so we got the three of swords reverse here. So I do feel like uh, some kind of ending of a relationship is going to happen. I do feel like somebody getting ready to get exposed, okay, with that moon coming out that um, I found out you was just using me, okay? And now I'm about to uh, break the friendship off, okay? I can't be your friend because I know the reason that you're really here. You don't want to be my friend. You just want to use me, okay? So we got the Ten of Cups here. So I do feel like it's weird because it could be family members that are coming trying to do this, okay? Um, but I do feel like you could have looked at this person like family, okay? I really like this person. This person is cool. 
But you know, you hear through the grapevine what this person really feels and you finding out that this person just only wants to be around for the benefits that you bring. And now, you know, you got to cut off this person that you really care about. Okay. But other than that, that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.